I'm gonna show you how to unlock your body gate for health and vitality. Are you absolutely frustrated with your body? You wanna be healthy, but some kind of sickness, some kind of disease, or some kind of problem in your body is just holding you back. You're not able to do the things that you used to do because of something stopping you and your body's not letting you do it. What you're about to see is a lesson from one of my courses that value over $1,000. And here you're gonna learn about it absolutely free. So pay close attention because before I learned about these techniques, I was sick, I was depressed, and have chronic illness that I suffer from every day. Ever since I learned about what I'm about to share with you, my life was completely transformed. I became a lot healthier, able to do a lot of things that I couldn't do when I was sick. So pay close attention because this might transform your life forever. That and more is coming up. Four ways to get unstuck in your life. So the first one is unlocking your body gates. In um, Chinese uh, martial arts and in meditation, tension is equal to blockage. So any kind of mental or uh, physical tension, that's a blockage in, in your chakras, in your body, okay? Disease is actually just a lack of ease or dis-ease. So a lot of our problems with the body is not because we it just comes into us is because we don't have that ease in our body. We have too much blockages. We have too much tension in our bodies that actually causes disease. Okay, so blockage of chi energy flow is a big problem, and it is caused by many things. So dieting, lack of exercise, external influences, also uh, emotional issues, traumas, and things like that cause blockages in our mind and body and then block the flow of energy in our bodies and my minds. Okay, so how, are we gonna, how can we activate this chi flow in our body? How can we like, unblock those blockages? So if you study uh, qigong or meditation or yoga or whatever, we have energy centers, we have chakras. And then I want to focus on our dantian, or also known as the navel chakra center. So let's do a exercise, qigong exercise right now. So why don't we all stand up and then this is a very easy exercise. We're just going to put our left hand over our belly button. Just imagine there's a, there's a center here, right? So this center goes right on top of your belly button, and then the right hand locks in like that, and then over your belly button like this. And I just want you to breathe through your nose, and then feel your belly getting bigger. Can you do that? So breathe through your nose, feel your belly get big, and then breathe out, feel your belly get small, okay? Breathe in, belly gets big, Breathe out, belly gets small. Do that a few times. So you go, look from the side, you can see my belly getting bigger. As I breathe in, breathe out. So do that. You can feel your belly coming in, back in and out, right? Okay. And if you do that, if you um, practice this a lot, you can actually get, like, how do you feel when you do that? More calm. More calm, yeah. How do you feel? Relax, okay? So when I'm doing this, I actually feel like I feel hotter, okay? So people have different senses. So, so what's happening is you're, you're, you're activating this chakra center, your, your navel chakra center. And in Chinese uh, martial arts, this is the center of your chi. It's called the sea of chi, translated. And this is like your battery source, okay? And this is what powers a lot of the processes in your body. It's also called this second psychic center. You know, there's so many nerves we have in our navel chakra center is actually just as many nerves as we have in our brain. So they call this the second psychic center because it actually is your second brain because it has just as many nerves as your brain. Okay, so when you have that gut feeling, you know, you've had that gut feeling before, it's actually thinking, <laughs> right? So there's another way to, to think about it. Okay, so second way that we do it, that's, so that's the first way, just breathing. Now the second um, kind of like a progression is to do the same thing, except when you are breathing out, add a little bit of pressure, like kind of push back down into, into your belly as you're breathing out. So add a little bit of like resistance to your breathing. So as you're pressing in, you're breathing out. So both hands on your belly, and kind of press, press into your belly, add some resistance, okay? 
Okay, and the third progression is I want you to do some consecutive breaths in and out. So we go go. So you dividing it into four breaths. Okay. One. In, 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 as it's coming out. Out, 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 out. So it, it makes, forces you to get control of that diaphragmic uh, muscle in your stomach. Okay? So how do you feel with that exercise? Calm and control. More control, more calm. How do you feel? Rhythm. Rhythm. All right. Okay, right, let's have a seat. Thanks. That's the beginning of starting to access that chi energy in your body naturally. You don't have to take any drugs. You don't have to do, you don't have to work out even. Like this is like a workout of your internal um, nervous system. So how are we going to turn negative energy into positive energy? We, uh, this is level four. There's also six healing sounds that cleanse your organs from the inside out. We discussed this in level four in the, in the course, uh, which you're going to get access to later. Okay. We're also going to talk about structure versus force. This is from level one, so if you want to go back to level one and review that, um, that also applies to this, of how to use power without using tension. And of course, you can do qi coil meditation to uh, open up your dantian, open up your sacral chakra, or open up all your chakras, because what the qi coil does is it activates and builds your qi automatically, um, and it adds to the practices that you're already doing with that meditation. Do exactly the same thing, except use this and put it on your belly. That's all you need to do. Hey, do you like what you're watching so far? I've got a lot more content for you that you're gonna love. So make sure you go and click these videos here and watch them next. If you haven't subscribed to this video, click the subscribe button here. And if you haven't taken the Qi Energy Score, click the link in the description below to take the quiz.